Hello everyone, Sigmalator here, and welcome to Resident Evil 4. Carrying on our Resident Evil saga with Resi 4. We'll stick with the normal costume, I think. 1998. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. Soon after, the news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. With the whole affair gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. <laughs> Why am I the one who always gets the short end of the stick? Yo, who are you really? Come on. You are a long way from home, cowboy. You have my sympathies. Guess that's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Then again, maybe you did. <laughs> oh, you crazy man. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. It was right before I was to take on my duties of protecting the president's daughter when she was abducted. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information about a sighting of a girl that looks very similar to the president's daughter. Apparently, she's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. Who would have thought that my first job would have been a rescue mission? Freezing. So cold all of a sudden. Ah, must be my imagination. Sorry it took so long. Just up ahead is the village. I'll go and have a look around. I will stay and watch that car. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. Jeez. Who are these guys? Did you say something? Leon, I hope you can hear me. I'm Ingrid Hunnigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. So the subject's name's Ashley Graham, right? That's right. She's the daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. 
I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. I should check that file. Oop, wrong button. Alright. Files. Alright, we've looked into that one. Playing manual one. Shooting, hold down around right here. Yep, combat knife. Info on Ashley. Ashley Graham, age 20, daughter of the United States President. She was kidnapped by an unidentified group while on her way home from her university. The kidnapper's, mo kidnapper's motives are still unknown, although there's, re there's reliable information that the perpetrator is an insider. Only a handful of people know about this kidnapping. It's been kept under wraps mostly due to the fact that we can't determine who the traitor is. The guys in intelligence say they have reliable information that Ashley's been sighted somewhere in Europe. But until we find out who the, ins who the insider is, I don't know what to believe. It could be a ploy. We have very few leads as to the whereabouts of Ashley, but members of the Secret Service and anyone else related to Ashley are being questioned by an investigative team. Even active agents are being investigated for any information. It's just a matter of time before the kidnapper is exposed. Oh, God. Shoot the crows. Whoops. Try not to waste your ammo. Get all the goodies. Some pesetas and a spinal. Thank you. Oops. Right. X to shoot, A to reload. That makes sense. Even though I brisked through the <laughs> file for the controls. Clearly, I didn't pay attention. Nothing there. Any nests in this area? No, I don't think there is. Uh, excuse me, sir? I was wondering if you might recognize a girl in this photograph. ¿Qué carajo estás haciendo aquí? Lárgate, cabrón! Sorry to have bothered you. Freeze! I said freeze! Don't think he's going to listen to you, Leon. Still local. I had no choice but to neutralize it. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. There he is there. Looks like they've killed a lot of people. I hope Hashdi's okay. He's not a zombie. Nope, very true.
Oof. I was expecting to sneak up on me that quickly. It has been a long time since I've played this. And the controls for Resident Evil 4 are not the best. How are these boys doing? Bridge is out. I can't go back this way. No, you cannot. Where are the officers? I hope they got out in time. Yeah. Probably would have been better for them to die there and then, in all honesty. Giving what's in store for them. Yes, Herb. Hanger bullets. Potatoes. Crow one. Crow two. Hey, Pooch. Don't worry, I got you. Avoid the bombs and the bear traps. Hello. It's too far away, apparently. Guess there's no sex discrimination here. Better find her fast. Will you give me anything? No. You will though, thank you. I wonder where they're going. Hello. Oh, wrong one. Right, let's get this organised for a start. There we go. Grenades down there. Health up there. Ammo there. That will do for now. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Hello? Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, honey. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. Hope you find it useful. I'll take a look at it. Thanks. Control configuration changes are not reflected here. Please pay careful attention to button functions. Reloading. Press A while holding down RT to reload your firearm. Yeah, I figured that bit out. Kicks. Approaching enemies that are either stunned or on their knees will allow Leon to perform kicks as prompted by the action button. Yep, yeah, we figured that bit out. Changing inventory screens. Use LB or RB to switch back and forth between weapons, recovery and the keys treasure, treasure screen. Cool. Useful stuff. That's one of the poor sods there.
They're really just, just doing their thing. Oops. Hello. Just pop it here quickly. Yeah, that's going to help. Grab all these. So let's go round the stairs, please, Leon. Shotgun! <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, big fellas here. You there. Okay. Equip you. Come on. And how about one of these to finish you off? Oh, do not say that's cancelled out my grenade. Really? Right, he's dead. That's a plus at least. <coughs> Come on everyone. One at a time, take a number.
Getting too many of you coming in here now. Come on. Ho <laughs> ho Multiple headshots. Ah, oh, thank you. I need to go back up to that roof and grab those bits they all drop before they disappear. Lord Where's everyone going? Bingo? Apparently so. Confirmed the body of an officer. Something's happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Right. Back up here first, quickly. Hopefully this lot haven't disappeared. No. Perfect. All right. What in God's name? If only he'd come with me. Now, I don't think his fate would have been any different, Leon. Chickens, right. Yellow herb, excellent. Put you right in there. Another red herb. Check all the buildings, collect all of the things. There are several small items here, nothing useful though. Fair enough. The world's most powerful knife. Jill is no longer the master of unlocking. Sorry, Jill. There's a dirty bed here. It appears that the stains are a person's blood. Lovely. Put you there for now. Do some proper organising once we've increased the briefcase space. Don't think there's anything around here, is there? No. All right. Well, that can't be good for your knees. Any bear traps around here? No. I think you're empty, if I remember rightly. Yes. You, on the other hand. Alert order. Recently, there's been information that a United States government agent is here investigating the village. Do not let this American agent get in contact with the prisoner. For those of you not yet informed, the prisoner is being held in an old house beyond the farm. We will transfer the prisoner to a more secure location in the valley when we are ready. 
The prisoner is to stay there until further notice. Meanwhile, do not let the American agent near the prisoner. We do not know how the American government found out about our village, but we are investigating. However, I feel this is this intrusion at this particular time is not just a coincidence. I sense a third party other than the United States government involved here. My fellow men, stay alert. Chief Betores Mendez. Yes. Who could that be, I wonder? I'll deal with those in a bit. Whoops. Yes, I agree. Who's going to get to me first? Still not dead. There we go. Alright, just take out you. How about the blue medallions? Fifteen blue medallions, seven in the farm, eight in the cemetery. For those of you who destroy ten or more will be awarded. The rest is illegible. Cool. There's two. Hi, cows. Now, can I actually get you with the knife? I've never actually tried. No, it doesn't look like it. I will take the egg, thank you. I can't believe this. There are these are all dead bodies. Hey pooch. I thought I heard footsteps that weren't my own. Right, no blue medallions there. No, there's one over there. No offence chickens, but you came towards me. It is not my fault you got scared. Shit. Yeah, I thought one of you came through there. In your own time, buddy. Where are you? Aren't you lucky to have infinite axes? Not that that helped you much. How do you miss at that distance, Leon? More 
potatoes. Thank you. That's five. And it's meant to be seven. Ah. Six, and that makes you seven. You're a bit too far away. Damn it. Cool, that's the village clear. And eight in the cemetery, was it? Fifteen, yes. Yes, I'll take you. All right, we are clear. Oh, God. I've seen this same post before. I hate these moments. Sprint! Sprint, Leon! <sighs> Grab that spinal. Can I... Yes! This is why I don't like these controls. They, they're not responsive enough. This is why I firmly believe 4 will benefit greatly from the remake treatment. Okay. Fifteen is the max shotgun. That's interesting. Oh, <laughs> nice shot. Did you drop anything for me? This area is basically done. Thank you. Yeah. Make sure everything's loaded to the max. Is all that racket about, eh? Nice. 
not the most not the best use of ammo but I'm not taking out those things with a knife that's for damn sure who could be in here I wonder Smooth. God, look at that. Hit ratio, 86%. Enemies killed, 37. Number of times killed, zero. That is what I like to see. And with that in mind, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been Resident Evil 4, and I will catch you next time. Take care now.